Hi everyone, and welcome to a DC World live stream. I'm Paul. Thank you all for joining me. Uh, trying out Periscope, so we're uh, having a little uh, muck around on there. Thanks for joining DC World. Hi, Todd isn't dead. Thanks for joining me. Going to be doing lots of giveaways. Probably going to talk for about 15 minutes to half an hour. We'll try and fit in what I can. Hi, Shark of Largo. I'll try and read everyone's messages as, uh, as I can read them. Um, just wanted to do a live stream of uh, everything that's going on at the minute with Wonder Woman about to come out in a couple of weeks um, and all the DC TV shows. Evening everybody, Shark of Largo, Flash University, thanks for joining me. Um, thought I'd announce this tonight, like from yesterday, so people had a chance to know I was going to be doing it rather than it will be spare in a moment. Um, um, are you all up to date with The Flash up to last week before I start spoiling it for anybody? Flash University, thanks for the shout out. If you're not up to date with The Flash, I'm about to say who Savitar was. Uh, I don't know if you guessed, I did guess it months ago. Um, but yes, at the minute, Savitar is another Barry Allen. Um, we are going to do some question and answers. I'll try my best. Yeah, fire them over. Uh, I'll try and read them as I'm talking. Uh, but yeah, Savitar was revealed to be the uh, Barry Allen uh, at the end of last week. It's going to carry on this week. Can't wait to see that episode. And uh, especially towards the end of the season of The Flash. Absolutely blowing it out of the water this season. Um, what did you think of the reveal of Savitar? Did you guess it right? By the way... If you like this t-shirt, I have plenty to give away tonight. I've got t-shirts, I'll show you everything as we go on. I've got cups, t-shirts, toys, goodies, boxes. It's all going to be given away tonight. Um, if you have any questions, fire them away. Hopefully we get to know which Barry's next episode we was sick. It was sick, yeah, and see what we hopefully see what, uh, what Barry this is and where he's from. Still want to know where he got all this scarring down his face. Some people were saying it's from uh, the time rim that he created and caught fire. If you were one of the Flash writers, creators, who would you want to be Savitar from Caramel OTA? Who would I want to be Savitar? Do you know what? I think they've done a good twist here. Um, but maybe it could have been Eddie. It could have been Ronnie. I think it was actually open to be anybody could have been a Savitar. Um, so how they've done it. I think it kept everyone guessing, but you remember episodes and episodes ago, they said, um, Savitar said, I am the future Flash. I think there was a big clue there. That's when I, I noticed it. So, made a video of his car sent to you. Yeah, send me the video later about the scar. I'll have a watch. Um, guys, let's give something away first to get everyone going. <laughs> I'll give away. I've some of these. These are only in a medium size, UK size. I'll, give, I'll send it all over the world. Got some of... Uh, this Batman t-shirt. Who wants to win this Batman t-shirt? Now the way I'm going to have to do this, I'll ask you a question, the first person to answer me will win it, and you'll have to uh, message me on Twitter after what you've won and uh, your name and address. So, this Batman t-shirt is going to go to the first person who can tell me who else is Bruce Wayne? Nice easy questions. Win this t-shirt. Who is Bruce Wayne? Also known as, I should have said. Flash University, you was first. Yep, you got Batman. This is yours. Message me after on Twitter, you've won a Batman t-shirt, and I'll send that straight over to you. That's the first giveaway of the evening. Anyway, there's plenty more to come. Um, what do you want to talk about, guys? This is new to me doing a live stream, so uh, I find this easier than doing a bit of a... I haven't got any flash shirts, no, I'm sorry. Um, I do have a DC World flash mug, and I do have a nice flash keyring there, so maybe someone will come in both of those in a minute. We'll do something there. Mug looks it, thank you. All the designs were uh, designed by Adam Carr. He's done my website, and he's updating that now, and he he done me all these logos for every show, and then... Uh, I've got a load of cups made with them all on, because I love them all, so if, uh, that's where these mugs come from, the DC world with the Flash. You won't believe it, but the Flash writers in America 
I even sent them some of these and some Supergirl ones, and they've actually got them in the writer's office. I know one of the guys there, and I sent him a load of stuff. So uh, I'd love to see it in the Flash one now on an episode. This on the table, just to be like, that's one of mine. Um, hi, Radical Games. Thanks for joining me. Uh, welcome, Tommy Carter. First down Periscope, Tommy Carter. Well done. I haven't used it that much. Um, I'm also going to be giving away... These two Wonder Woman posters, so someone's going to win them tonight as well. Um, are you looking forward to Wonder Woman, everyone? Let me know. A um, couple of weeks, what's it, three weeks now, I think, and Wonder Woman's out, so I'm excited to go and see that one. And you're looking forward to it as a, the next part of the DC movie universe. I definitely am, and then the Justice League. Yeah, it's a deal, Habibi, as well. Hi, thanks for joining. I'm say thanks for joining everybody. Uh, weren't short notice, but... Um, I appreciate everyone live streaming. I don't know what to say because I don't know what everyone wants to talk about. So, uh, bear with me. Um, it's Tom who won the giveaway. Nice one. World of Flash. Nice little shout out to you there. Um, I will start trying to get back into YouTube and I'll upload this to YouTube anyway later. But YouTube for me is so time consuming in a minute and this is nice, it's live, it's done and the video is stored, I can upload it later. What do you want to see in the new Wonder Woman trailer? Would revealing areas be the right thing to do? Uh, Todd isn't dead. I'm going to say, I got the hump last year when they showed Doomsday, the Batman v Superman trailer. Um, but we already saw a little bit of Ares the other week with the other trailer that came out. You see his arm and the axe or whatever he's holding there. Um, I think... They could show a glimpse of him. Apparently the uh, new trailer's coming tonight with Gal Gadot at the uh, MTV Awards. So, um, we'll wait and see now. Is it the right thing to go? Possibly. Um, I'll answer your question in a minute who I think the best Flash villain is. Uh, but yeah, Wonder Woman, I think we all know Ares is in there. We've seen the toys and figures and stuff that's been leaked. So, I think as a final trailer and it's almost there, it doesn't bother me if we actually see him. We actually know he's in that now, as where Batman v Superman, we didn't actually really know Doomsday was going to be in there, and then it, it came out in the trailer, and I thought, oh, I don't believe it. So, uh, I am hyped for Wonder Woman, yes. Going to go back to the Flash, my best Flash villain so far, I still say, I know Zoom was great, um, but I still like the reverse Flash. Uh, it was just the twist, you know, from Amazon Wells, and then... Eobard, uh, and when it twisted later in the series and you see him becoming, oh, I loved it. And uh, I'd love to see the reverse flash back again one day. Uh, if you're watching Legends of Tomorrow, that's been great this season because the reverse flash has been in there. Um, so, are you liking Legends of Tomorrow? I absolutely loved it. Just a shame it's a short season for Legends of Tomorrow. Uh, hopefully season three, they pick up a few more and it gets like a nice full series run. Uh, absolutely, uh, Legends of Tomorrow has been great. Are you watching Gotham? Are you watching Arrow? I'm sure you all are. Um, loving them. Gone off Powerless a little bit. I've not seen the last three or four. It's gone down the pan, and I thought um, Powerless was going to be really good when it started. Um, but now, Powerless, I think uh, it's in danger, that one. Gotham has been good from Flash Universe. Yes, Gotham has been brilliant. I've loved this season. Um, I just wonder how they're going to turn around now. They've got Bruce, and they've swapped them. I wonder if they're going to go towards the end of the season. Then an older Bruce comes back for season four. I don't know. I just don't know how long they're going to keep going with Gotham. Um, until you see Bruce Wayne growing up. Obviously, David, who plays uh, Bruce Wayne, is, is young. I think he's only like 15, 16, something like that. Um, I don't know if he can age enough every season. Will they eventually use someone else who's a bit older to start playing Bruce Wayne and, and with all the fighting and everything going on in Gotham? But... What did you think of the Riddler? I am so excited, he's, back. he's in it now. Um, like the Riddler, and he's the first one who's actually now got the name, apart from Penguin. Um, but the Riddler has now took on the whole outfit, and uh, he is now the Riddler in Gotham. Um, absolutely loving Gotham this season. Uh, met a lot of the cast from that already, there's some more coming up. Are you going to any conventions, guys? A couple of conventions coming up soon in the UK. Um, two weeks' time, we've got... Rogue Events City of Heroes 3 in Telford with the Telford Fan Zone. It was actually in the same, the build, same building. There's some stars there from The Flash, Legends, um, Supergirl. That's all going on there. And then the week after is the big one in London, Heroes and Villains Fan Fest. Are you going to that? 
I'm excited to be going to that. I've got a press pass, so I've got VIP access to queue in and everything else. Can't wait for that one. Uh, are you going to that event? That's going to be a good one in London at the Olympia. Almost 30 stars they've got at that one. Anybody want to ask any questions? Somebody must be out there. Help me out, guys. Are you going to call the... Are you going to video? I'm going to probably video what I can there. Um, I'm even trying to get some interviews with some of the stars at the moment, so I'm just waiting for answers on that one. Um, but I'll, I will be videoing at Heroes and Villains. I might even try and do a bit of this periscope in there, just so you guys can see, you guys can see a bit of live what's going on, us queuing up or trying to meet the stars. I, I, I will get photos there and uh, I'll be uploading stuff as the, as the weekend goes on there. Uh, also going to Stephen Amwell's Knocking Point wine party on the Saturday evening. Looking forward to that. Some of the stars are going to be in there. So that could be a, could be some stories coming out of that on Sunday. Ask questions away, guys. Anything DC Comics, TV, film, whatever. Go through it. <laughs> Help anybody. Somebody's there. I'm going to give away something next. Let's get you going. Let's go with... I don't know what to go with next. I've got some of these. DC Comics Ultimate Character Guide books. It's actually like about A to Z of every DC character. I'll give that away with... Let's go with... The DC World Arrow mug. Win that. Let's throw something else with it. Let's throw something else with it. We're throwing a comic of a cyborg there. Win these three items. Next, I'm going to ask a question. Again, first person to answer wins these items, and I'll be posting them to you very soon. Soon. Or very soon, even. Uh, let's go with... Hmm. Which planet is kal from? First person to answer wins these three goodies. I'm waiting for an answer. These will be yours as soon as that answer comes up on my screen. No one's answered. Krypton. <laughs> well, I'm sure you want something cool, really. <laughs> well, no one else has answered, so again, they've got to go to you, haven't they? So, they are your flash guy. You've won them now as well. If you're the only one streaming, then you're just going to win everything tonight. It's not fair. Now, yours. On my little pile there, ready to uh, go back through the video later. Direct message me what you've won and then uh, with your address. And then uh, I'll get everything shipped next week. Um, so, I've won four items technically. <laughs> you have, but maybe you're the only one watching. So you could end up winning everything. I don't know. <laughs> Anyone else watching, guys? Anyone want to ask any questions? 21 people are watching. Oh, there could be 21 winners there then. Perhaps some people you know to a periscope and don't want to message me, I don't know. What do you want to talk about? Do you want me to answer anything? When are you uploading on YouTube? I will upload this on YouTube after this is finished. I don't know, this could go on for 20 minutes, half an hour, I don't know, I'm going to just do it. Uh, this will be on tonight, this will be on YouTube tonight, so you can see it guys. You just want to show off what you won, Flash Guy. Um, anyone want to ask any questions? Fire away. I'm waiting. What your best TV show? Do you know what? Years ago, I loved Smallville. When that came out, that was great. And I just wish that was back now in this universe. Um, but currently, out of all the TV shows, uh, and obviously I'm a big DC fan, The Flash, for me, is blowing it out of the water. Um, loved Arrow, and obviously then we got The Flash. Uh, and Supergirl, I'm absolutely loving Supergirl as well. But The Flash, for me, at the moment, that's my that's my favourite TV show that's on at the minute. Until we get anything else that's coming, maybe at the end of the year or next year. You've seen the leaked trailers for Krypton. That actually looked really good, and I hope that's picked up, and that does get a series. Uh, excuse me. And um, we've got Black Lightning coming, and also whatever else is coming. We've got Titans next year, DC TV streaming service. Pardon me. So there's going to be other stuff coming. Um, 
And if TV, uh, like Netflix, have got a lot of the Marvel stuff, I think the DC one could have a few more shows that are going on behind the scenes here, and we don't know about those yet. So uh, looking forward to the Titans live action. Oh, that would be absolutely incredible, um, especially if they might tie it in with the, uh, the CW universe. CW? CW universe. Uh, that would be great. Welcome, come on, um, is their first day on Periscope, congratulations. Everyone's joining back, so the people have had to rejoin this, I don't know if this is time to do, right, I'm back, had connection issues. Welcome at Dream House of Home, is their first day, a lot of people first day on Periscope here. Yeah? We have had, ah, we have Hulk Pod, welcome to DC World, great guys, we have a Hulk Pod, uh, great guys on you, um, Twitter, give them a follow, actually give everyone a follow, we're all in the same thing, yeah? Couldn't type anything. <laughs> That's fine. Which planet was he actually from? Was that the answer? It is Krypton. You know it's from Krypton. It's kal It's Clark Kent. He's Superman. He's from Krypton. You've got it right. <laughs> the DC TV show. Welcome and thank you for joining me. You're blowing it out of the water at the minute on YouTube. I've been watching so uh, good. I've been here for ages as well. Some of the people. <laughs> hey, everybody. The DC TV show is here. Blood fire joined. Brilliant. Got a nice little audience going again there, guys. If you've, uh, you can watch all this later, I'll upload it on YouTube. It'll automatically play through. Uh, how long have you been a fan of DC shows? Car, since I was probably about four. Um, first DC movie I ever saw was Superman 1 with Christopher Reeve. I must have been four or five years old. Um, and that then probably got me, to be honest. Christopher Reeve as Superman was amazing. So that was my, uh, that is probably my all time favourite movie still. Uh, away from DC, what do you enjoy? Shark of Larko. What do I enjoy? I don't enjoy work. I go to work all day. Same completely out of the ordinary. But yeah, um, I enjoy my work. Uh, out of work, I enjoy my family life with my wife. I've got my stepson. I enjoy going out for dinner. I enjoy going to the cinema. Uh, I enjoy going to conventions, meeting stars. I love it. So yeah, a bit about me, what I do. Um, any other questions, anyone? I missed a few there. They come up, but I was talking... Favourite female DC character? Oh, you're going to get me there. Favourite DC character, who is female? See, a lot of you probably think I'd say Harley Quinn, but I actually love Kara, Supergirl. She's my favourite. Nothing to do with Superman, just I think she is badass. I love Kara. Do you have fun? I do have Funko Pops, and a lot of them are signed. I'm getting some more signed in a couple of weeks. I can't get them out now. I'll get them out in a future video. I'll show you my Funko Pop collection. Uh, most of them are signed, so uh, I'll show you. At Bloodfire, yay, nice. So my Loomis has joined. Welcome. Same me, I love Car Supergirl. Awesome. Good choice there. Who's ready for a giveaway? Um, seeing as we're talking about Supergirl, something Supergirl to give away. With... Uh, something else. Let's give away some Supergirl stuff coming up. I'm gonna get. Don't watch Supergirl. It is good, and this season's very good. Uh, and Superman's back in a couple of weeks, so you should be watching Supergirl. Next questions coming up. Bear with me, guys. Let's give away. By the way, with everyone who wins, we'll get some of these posters. I've got some little uh, Justice League and Wonder Woman double-sided posters there. Everyone will get them in their parcel. Right, so let's give away some stuff like Superman comic and a DC World Kara Zorel Supergirl mug. I'm going to ask one question. First person to answer will win these two. Um, <laughs> what will be the answer? Name one arch enemy of Superman. First person to answer wins these two. All my giveaways are real, by the way, guys. I give everything away. DC TV show has answered Lex. Everyone is now asking Lex. But DC TV show, you've just won those two. You've got the answer in first. Direct message me after the video with what you've won. I'll watch this back anyway uh, with your name and address. And I'll send these over to you. I'm just going to put them to the side because that's the third giveaway. There's more giveaways coming, guys. I've got tons of stuff here I've got to clear out so there's loads of stuff um, there's going to be a DC World mystery box coming to somebody the DC TV show biggest Supergirl fan I swear 
Bloodfire was first. Oh, well, on my screen, the DC TV show come up first. I can only go by what I'm seeing, guys. There's plenty more to come, though. Um, what do you want to talk about? Any questions on the DC TV shows or the DC movies? And certainly, Justice League coming out at the end of the year. Massive one. Can't wait for that. Oh, mystery box fancy. <laughs> nice shirt. I've got these shirts. I have some to give away. They're right here. Who do you, why do you tweet the same thing on both Twitter accounts? Because my Twitter account is linked to my personal Twitter account and it automatically does it for me. I, I will uh, stop it one day, so um, at the minute it's just linked, so I, I will. Uh, if it's annoying you, I'll try and undo it. Do you like Marvel? I do like Marvel. Wednesday Guardians of the Galaxy 2 last week. Uh, actually liked it, weren't bad. I thought the film could have been better. Um, Guardians of the Galaxy was good. Again, I like the Avengers. I love all the Avenger films. Looking forward to the Infinity War. Uh, can't wait for that. Watch Captain America, Iron Man, Spider-Man. I do, I'll go and watch them all. It's just, I, I'm more of a DC fan, so I'll do a DC world. Um, just don't have time to do a Marvel world as well, otherwise I would do. Uh, oh, I didn't know you could do that. Yep, you can do that. DC TV show has joined back again. Um, yeah, you can double link your Twitter accounts. I think I, I Twitter off my DC World Twitter and it puts it on my Facebook page and it also links to uh, my personal one. So instead of doing three tweets, I'll just press it once. Do you think the last episode of Arrow was good? Um, it was okay. Oliver and Felicity had a little bit of time together. Um, yeah, it was okay. Uh, you think we'll see the trailer of Soups before release? Personally, I hope not. Do you know what? I really hope we don't see Superman for uh, any of the trailers for the Justice League and we just see him turn up in the movie. Uh, I want it to be a big surprise. Um, again, in Batman v Superman, didn't know he was going to die and that actually done me in the cinema. I was shocked and it was like a big surprise. I was in bits. So um, I want his return kept a big secret for Justice League. I don't want to see how he returns. I'm going to move back a bit. You can see the poster there. I don't want to see how Superman comes back. Shark of Largo. Nice one. Wally West, Jesse Quick from Flash. Wally West or Jesse Quick? Wally West for me. Zachary, Zachary joined. Excellent. Nice little uh, crew here. Um, any more questions, anyone? I think someone asked me about something on Supergirl, but I missed it. Come up, sorry. When do you think the Vigilante will end up being... Oh, do you know what? That is winding me right up. Who is the Vigilante in Arrow? I haven't got a bloody clue. That is just one of these. I think we've we've been on about Savitar so much we forgot about Vigilante in Arrow. Um, give me your thoughts on Vigilante. I don't know. I think Captain Fire joined. Me too, me too. Ike 44 has joined. Got a few joiners now. Love it. Um... I don't want to talk about. I've been talking on for 22 minutes. Have you found any early screenings for Wonder Woman? Not yet. I know in the UK we've got it on uh, June the 1st. I've actually emailed Warner Brothers to try and get a press ticket. So if I get to see it a few days early, guys, I will let you know. First time I've tried. Best Supergirl character apart from Supergirl. Ooh. Um, in the Supergirl TV show? Or overall in comics and stuff? Poster's falling off the wall there. <laughs> DC in Supergirl, hmm. See, I'm not a lover of the Jimmy Olsen in there. Um, and the Ally McBeal character who was in there. I'm glad she went. I know she's back. Why are poor Wally? Oh, why are poor Wally West? Wally West, of course. Next one. Best DC Legends character in Legends. Do you know what? Because I love him. Brandon Ralph as the Atom. Absolutely brilliant. He played a good Superman. And for me... Um, I love the Atom. I just think there ain't enough of the Atom shrinking down and doing superhero stuff in Legends. I just seem to fit it in every now and again. Um, yep, absolutely love the Atom in Legends of Tomorrow. He's probably my favourite there. At the minute, anyway, till we get some uh, new characters for Legends Season 3. He's so happy, though. <laughs> he is at Bloodfire, yes. <laughs> uh, I hope Legends Season 3 is good. Flash University. Well... I think Legends Season 3 is going to step up again. I think they're doing really well. Um, even with last season, with all the reverse flashes and John Barrowman in it and that. You're a big Superman fan. Your favourite take on the character? I said it earlier. DC sucks. I think you dare you. Uh, my favourite is Christopher Reeve as Superman. 
can't go wrong there. Uh, grew up with him from when I was born. I was born in 79, and then Superman came out in 78, or was made in 78. So, um, <laughs> so um, Christopher Reeve for me was my ultimate Superman, still is, uh, followed by Henry Cavill. Got to be the one now. I can't beat up. Where am I no, not all about DC, do it. All DC characters. This is all DC, this video. Uh, but yeah, I spoke earlier about Marvel, and uh, oh, yeah, I don't mind some Marvel stuff. Just I'm more of a DC fan, so uh, I think the characters are stronger and darker in DC than the Marvel. Marvel's getting a bit too uh, Disney fired, is what I call it. A lot of you won't like that. Do you sell any of your collections? I do sell some autographs off. Keep an eye probably next month or so. I might get a few extras at the convention, so uh, there might be some signed Funkos and pictures coming. Uh, just some extras. I always buy more than I need. Favorite villain on Supergirl, Flash, and Arrow. Oh. Arrow, easy. Uh, Deathstroke so far. Absolutely loved him. Uh, the Flash uh, would be Eobard Fall, the reverse Flash. Um, <laughs> Deathstroke, reverse Flash. Deathstroke or reverse Flash. I'm going to say reverse Flash all day long. He'll kick Deathstroke's ass, wouldn't he? <laughs> I love Savitai and Prometheus. Yep, yeah, there have been some good villains this season. I think last season of Arrow struggled. This season of Arrow's turned around. They've gone a bit back to the roots. Who's top of your list to meet from the DC films and shows? Well, met a lot of them, but I still want to meet Gal Gadot. I stood in front of Gal Gadot last year, but they wouldn't let her come over to the crowd because she was late, so they just dragged her up the carpet. Uh, I'd like to meet her. You're getting Injustice 2. I don't have a console anymore, so I'm not getting Injustice 2, but the game looks amazing. Hopefully, it's going to be on the iPhone, so I can play it on there. They did it with Injustice 1, so... um. Injustice 2, hopefully, will come out again um, at the same time on iOS. How long is this stream to be? Do you know what? I don't know how long. I was planned it for about 15 minutes, and I've gone on for nearly half an hour. Um, stream probably for another 10, 15 minutes, guys. Have you ever met the whole cast of Supergirl? No. I'm about to meet the whole cast of the Supergirl, though, in the next two weeks. They, um, Jimmy Olsen's here. Melissa's here. Already got all my photo ops booked. Um... Uh, Charla Lee's here, Super Carla's sister in Supergirl, she's over, um, Wynn is over, um, I'm missing people here, There's, the whole cast of Supergirl is in the UK in two to three weeks time, some at Rogue Events, City of Heroes in Telford in two weeks, if you haven't got a ticket there's some available, I know you just want to meet Melissa, I'm meeting Melissa, and be, well, uh, be ready for some pictures because I've got some photo ops booked. Um, and also the week after Heroes and Villains Fan Fest in London, still got tickets available for the Sunday, Bank Holiday weekend in May. That is one not to miss. Uh, probably, apparently a lot of queuing up there though, so we'll, we'll see what happens at that one. Uh, but yeah, really looking forward to meeting all the uh, Supergirl cast and, and the Martian Man, uh, David Hillwood's over. Do you know how much it is for the autographs at Heroes and Villains? No, nobody does yet, but from what I'm reading on the forums, Heroes and Villains autographs are probably going to start around £25-£30 and go up to about £60 per autograph, and I know they do selfies at the desk. Um, so, uh, be prepared to take some money if you're going to get autographs and selfies and stuff, because uh, I know Heroes and Villains is a little bit pricier than others, but then they do get the good, uh, good people over as well. Would you be a hero or villain? Hero, all day long I would be a hero, and I'd be Superman. I'm meeting Melissa, maybe Chris Wood. Yep, I'm meeting him. I forgot Chris Wood's coming, I've got that as well. Um, a lot of them meeting on the Saturday and some on the Sunday. Are you a Caramel fan? I am a Caramel fan, yep. Boo, have you met Grant Gustin? No, he is one I need for my set. I've got a poster with everyone on signed. He's my only one missing on there. Um, you would be Captain Cold. Nice one. Actually, Captain Cold and Heatwave are over here at the uh, Heroes and Villains. No, they're at Rogue Event City of Heroes 3. Oh, I nearly slipped up there. Your alter ego name. Oh, my alter ego name. Oh, I don't know. What would my alter ego be? Don't know. <laughs> I can't think of one. My alter ego, like Clark Kent. If I was a superhero, what would my alter ego be? Oh, Jermaine in Gotham's amazing. Who, who have you booked to meet at Heroes and Villains Fan Fest from the DC to I have booked? Melissa Benarist, uh, Josh, who's Prometheus, um, Jimmy Olsen, I've, uh, you're going to get me now, Stephen Amell, 
Stephen Amell with Melissa Benares, double op on the Sunday. Can't wait for that one. Um, and there's more. I can't just remember who I've booked. <laughs> I've booked, there's about eight people I've booked because I've met the rest of them. So, uh, yeah, Heroes and Villains is about eight I'm meeting there at the minute. Who are you meeting? DC TV show? Who are you looking forward to meet at Heroes and Villains Fan Fest? What city do you live in? I live in Essex in the UK near London. I'm meeting Melissa Benoist. I think everyone's going to meet Melissa. I think her tickets have nearly sold out. There's about five left this morning, so Melissa Benoist is going to be amazing. Um, a big queue there for that one. I wish I could go. Bloodfire shared on Twitter. Thank you for sharing this, guys. Stephen Amell. He's great as well. Great to have a photo with him. I live in Wolverhampton, close to Telford, but I can't go to Telford. Oh, man. Sorry to hear that. Going to try and meet Chris Wood or Stephen. Ah, nice one. Um, I think they just queue, you queue up for autos in different groups at Heroes and Villains and Fan Fest, and they do like VIP and Gold and everyone. But I think they do a mixture at a time. It's not everyone who's standard tickets queues up for ages. It's going to be a few Gold, few VIP, a few normal people, and they do them, and then they do another section. So it's a bit of a mixture. So it uh, shouldn't be too bad. I think you can queue up to about an hour to get some autographs at Heroes and Villains Fan Fest from what I'm hearing. Um, I've never been to one, so this is going to be a new one for me. Would you have a partner if you were a hero? Oh! No. I wouldn't have a partner if I was a hero. Because it don't go too well with Batman and Robin, does it? And you've got to, you've got to look out for somebody then. Um, with VIP entry, is it good seats? Yes, it is. I think you can sit right at the front in the talks of VIP entry. Uh, and I know you've seen first as well. So VIP entry at Heroes and Villains Fan Fest. Um, from what I know, you get... Priority uh, autograph, priority on your photo shoots and seating in the front of the talks and stuff and you're allowed to take pictures and that there, so that's pretty good. Todd isn't joined Todd isn't yet joined again. He's joined about four times. Must be a lot of people having connection issues here. Anything else you want to talk about? Um or should I do another giveaway? Who do you think will be Harley Quinn in Gotham? No idea, yeah. I know they're rumouring Barbara, but I don't I can't see that happening. They're gonna have someone else. When is the when is this Nick? No, Heroes and Villains Fan Fest is in three weeks. Telford uh, City of Heroes is in two weeks, so start getting tickets if you ain't got tickets already. Two weeks, Rogue Event, City of Heroes in Telford, in Telford Fan Zone. And in three weekends' time is Heroes and Villains Fan Fest London Olympia. DC TV show, sold out, pretty sure. How many giveaways are you going to have? I've done about three, I'm going to do another one right now. Of uh, some stuff, let me find. Da -da 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 -da. Right, let's go for... I'm going to do a triple giveaway here. Someone's going to win all these three items. I'm just going to show. So you can win. DC World logo Gotham Cup. With one of these Batman t-shirts that I'm wearing. This one. And a Batman figure. If you can see that, it's a bit shiny. So you will win all these three items. And I'm going to ask one question. First person I see comes up. Wonder Woman giveaway's coming. So... These three items going to the first person to answer, whoever I see come up on my screen. Um, so, to win these, I'm going to ask a question. First answer wins them. Batman related items. So it might as well be a Batman question, mightn't it? Go with that. Let's go with... Hmm... <laughs> Who is Dick Grayson? First answer wins these three items. In Batman, who is Dick Grayson? Nightwing, Caramel OTA, you are the winner, I'll take that. I know he's Robin, but we'll have Nightwing. They are on their way to you. Direct message me and you have won, Caramel. You must have seen it. So uh, message me your name and address details. I'll get these sent over to you. I'll play this back if I've not heard from anybody, it's just so I can chase you up after. By the way, if you've won anything on uh, this video today, I've done about four, three or four giveaways. Try and reply to me within the next 24 hours or send me your name and address so I know what I'm... Uh, and say what you actually won so I can remember and I'll send them to you. Um, I am going to give away these two massive 
Wonder Woman posters, so there will be the next giveaway. Nightwing is good. What is your opinion on the character, Paul? Oh, I like Nightwing, and you know what? I'm really the DC TV show that I'm talking to you. Uh, I'm hoping we're going to get Nightwing in Titans next year. Uh, it's going to be amazing that show with all the characters we're going to have in it. It's going to be like another version of Legends, but probably a little bit darker and stuff. So the take on Nightwing, I actually like him. Yep, I prefer him than Robin. So I'm looking forward to Titans and live action and hopefully, probably before the end of November, October, we should start seeing some pictures and photos of who they're going to have as characters for Titans. So that'd be good to see uh, who is going to get to play Nightwing in that one. I can't wait for a Wonder Woman and Flash giveaway. I've done a Flash giveaway already. When do you think we are going to have new Wonder Woman trailer? I think you are right there. At Dream of Home, Wonder Woman trailer apparently rumoured for tonight at the MTV Awards, which will be the final trailer. Somebody asked earlier, do you think we're going to see Ares in there, um, or does it bother me? You've already seen a glimpse of him in the trailer, so I think now it doesn't bother me if we actually see him. We all know he's, he's in the movie, because you've seen the toys and stuff out. Um, as where with Batman and Superman, we didn't see Doomsday till that trailer come out and ruined it all. So, uh, yeah, I think tonight is going to be the last trailer for Wonder Woman. So, these posters will be going as my next giveaway in a couple of minutes. I'll have to think of... Uh, a Wonder Woman related question for these two. And you win them two posters. Wonder Woman is going to be good. Wonder Woman is going to go bloody epic. Can't wait. Um, been a long time coming for a, a Wonder Woman to get on the big screen. So uh, really looking forward to that one. Are you looking forward to seeing Wonder Woman? And Justice League. We've got a pucker year this year for films. As DC fans anyway. Everyone's joining just for giveaways, I think. <laughs> Do you read any comment? I re I've been reading Rebirth up to a couple of months ago, then I fell behind. So, uh, Paul, I want to get an everybody early press screening. Do you fancy... I'll come to an early press screening. If you get a ticket, I'm coming. Same as I I've applied for early press screenings for Wonder Woman, but I'm waiting to hear from Warner Brothers, so I'm trying my best. Favourite Harley Quinn version? In comic TV or that? Oh, Harley Quinn... I don't know on Harley Quinn, can't comment on that one. Favourite Suicide Squad character? Oh, do you know what? Will Smith as Deadshot. Uh, loved him in that. He was absolutely great. Um, absolutely loved the scene, especially when he was in the alley with his little girl and then Batman comes down. That was a big surprise. So, but Will Smith as Deadshot is probably my favourite in Suicide Squad. Even the scene where he's saving everybody and he's killing everybody with his guns. So, uh, next one, Caramel OTA. Favourite DC movie? My favourite DC movie of all time is going to be Superman 1 with Christopher Reeve, end of. Uh, Batman kissed Harley, yes he did. <laughs> favourite Harley Quinn, Batman, what is your favourite DC? Um, they're coming up, the questions, but then they're fading, so I'm not getting to read them all, guys. Sorry if I'm missing you. Or message me again, I'll answer. It loads up about two or three on my phone, and then they fade away, so I can't read the questions. Sorry. Batman or Superman? Superman all day long, my friend. That's the Flash Universe YT. Was it? Or was it University? I like how you spelled it there. <laughs> my wife thinks I'm mad doing this, by the way. Superman the movie is the superhero movie of all others. Strived. You just hit it right on the head there, Shark of Largo. He is the one person I would still love to meet today, Christopher Reeve. Um, again, London Film and Comic Con in the summer. They've got four out of four, it's five. They've got four out of Superman on the movies. You've got Zod. I forgot the other two names. Oh my god, everyone's going to kill me. But the three villains from Superman too. <laughs> and Lois are there. I've booked a photo op with them. If I could be anyone in Supergirl, who would it be? Oh, who could I be in Supergirl? I'd be Martian Manhunter. How great is that? It could turn into anybody. Um, the Martian Manhunter I'd be in Supergirl. Favourite CW female? Melissa Benares, Supergirl, my favourite for the CW uh, female universe, guys. Great stuff, mate. Thank you, Shark of Largo. Nice little shout-out for you there. All right, let's get it on. Who wants to win? These two magnificent Wonder Woman posters. <laughs> I've been here for it. I've been here for ages. We need to read the Flash and Batman button crossover. Oh no, that's the bit I've not got up to yet. The button part. So uh, I've I've got to read them. I've just not had time. <laughs> Q 
kills the Avengers. Yes, it does. So, Wonder Woman posters up for grab next. Who wants to win two awesome Wonder Woman posters? How's that for a giveaway? These two, in fact, is what you'll get. I can even sign across them if you want me to learn them. Anyone want to win Wonder Woman posters? A few of you want to win? Right, get ready. I'm going to ask a question. First person on my screen to answer wins the two Wonder Woman posters. Uh, I'll try and send everything this week, so you should get them hopefully the week after, unless you're in America or anywhere, then it takes a bit longer. So, the question to win these two Wonder Woman posters, Wonder and Power. Where is Wonder Woman Diana from? Answer. Oh, at Todd isn't dead, you have won there, guy or lady. Maybe a man, maybe a woman, but you have won. At Todd isn't dead, you have won the two Wonder Woman posters. You were the first answer. Everyone's gone mad for them now. Um, everyone who's won will get some mini Wonder Woman posters included anyway. So other people get little mini posters. Um, they must get what you can't spell. <laughs> Uh, message me on Twitter, DM me your your name, address, and everything, so I can get them sent to you and what you've won. So I'll watch this back anyway, just to double check. But tell me what you've won, and then I'll get everything sent. Tweet some pictures, Instagram, YouTube, whatever you do, just to show what you've won for me when you get it. it just helps me as well. So get it all going. Um, anything else you want to talk about, guys? I've been going for forty-one minutes. I'm going to give it another four or five minutes, and I'm going to go. I'll do a live stream on what I won. <laughs> that will take you about an hour, that live stream, with everything you've won, Flash University. I can't even remember what you won now, so you'd have to message me. I know you won twice. <laughs> uh, I've got other stuff to give away, but I need to save stuff for Twitter and next month, so I've got plenty. Of, I'm looking at all this stuff here. There's tons of gear you can't see. I think I won Batman stuff. I forgot. I think you did. But... Do not panic. I'll watch the video back later and I can say who's won what. So I'll know, don't worry. I'm going to give it another three minutes, guys. So I'm 45 minutes and then I'm going to go. Uh, but I'll maybe do this again next weekend. I like doing this live stream and chatting with you all. The one time my connection didn't throw me out. <laughs> Jason, yep. Nice one. <laughs> Good connection there then, mate. So you, uh, you actually won something because of that. Nice Justice League poster there, that may be up for grabs soon. I've got some more. Oh, I'm sorry you didn't win. There's going to be plenty more to give away from DC World. Follow me on Twitter, at underscore DC World. I'm on Instagram, DC World underscore. I'm on YouTube, Facebook page, DC World fan page. I'll try and get on everything as much as I can. I have a family life, so I do all my DC World stuff as and when I can fit it in. Um, so that's why I've not really got madly into YouTube yet. It takes me ages to edit the videos because I like doing the green screen stuff and showing what I'm talking about. But this is just easy. So I wish I could get stuff like this. Well, I have to buy some of this stuff. I don't get it sent to me for nothing. And I'll just give it away to you guys. I've got some stuff I'll keep. The rest I'll give it away. So I've also got a website, www.dcworld.org.uk. That is getting updated right now, uh, and in a few months it's going to go live. It's a whole new relaunch for DC World there. It's going to be a whole new website, and it's going to be uh, across all the shows. You can select what you want to look at, anything I'll post, uh, a lot of stuff. That's nice of you to give it away. I do, I give loads of stuff away. I'll probably spend a bloody fortune on it as well, giving stuff away, but I try and get stuff from all over the place, or companies send me stuff. Like last year I had... Uh, Supergirl, Flash and Arrow, all the new DVDs come out and they sent me them like two weeks early, this company, and um, I gave the lot away, I've still got one left for myself, um, but I gave all those away last year to everybody and uh, I'm in touch with them still, so hopefully as the next seasons come out on DVD in a few months, I'll, I'll try them again to get me uh, this media company to send me all the DVDs and I'll give them away as well, so that's going to be later in the summer. Well, I'm going to say thank you all for joining, I must have a good job mate. I do have a good job, thank you very much. <laughs> it's not bad. 
this is giveaways, international. International giveaway all the time. I'll post all over the world. I've posted to Italy, I've posted to Albania, I've posted to the United States of America, Ireland, England, Scotland, Wales. I'll send it anywhere. Six stream, can't wait for next week even with... I'll do a giveaway. I'll do a couple of giveaways in every stream. I don't care. <laughs> giveaway, not week. <laughs> can't stream. Great stream. Well, thank you everybody for watching. Because I do not live in the UK, I live in it. Doesn't matter where you live, if you've won a prize, I will send it to you. Doesn't, I don't care where you are, I'll pay the postage, I'll send it to you. So don't worry about that. DC World is global. I'll post all over the place for new prizes. Well, I'm going to go, guys. Thank you, everybody, for watching. I'm going to up this <laughs> up list. I'm going to upload this video to YouTube later on, so it'll be on there tonight. Thank you all for joining. Everyone's going to start messaging me for their prizes now, so I'll have a load of stuff coming through. But thank you all for watching. Follow me on Twitter, at underscore DC World. Instagram, DC World underscore. Um, for, especially for the events coming up in a couple of weeks. I'll get everything going on there so you can see what's going on. Or if you're going, come up and say hi. Or, or whatever. Can't wait. So it'd be great to see uh, some of the fans there. Um, thanks for watching, everybody. Thanks for joining in been absolutely amazing i can't believe i've talked for 45 minutes i'll let you go now uh, and i'm gonna go and get some dinner so thanks for watching everyone maybe see you all again next sunday but i'll announce it thank you everyone